Hi, welcome back to another installment of Tech Tip Tuesday. My name is Elena Berger and I'm a third grade teacher at Piney Woods Elementary. Today we're going to be talking about the new aware and how to create a new assessment. So go ahead and log in to your Splendora ISD, find your Edgephoria login, and you're going to go to Aware. Once you've made it to Aware, you're going to be on your overview page. You're going to see down here it says Assessments, list Last Visited Assessments. You can go to New Assessment. It says Create New Blank Assessment. Once you click that, it will take you straight to Author. Hit Standard Assessment. Create the title that you want it to have, your subject, your level, and then the type. You're going to add your course, and then it already has your campus created. You're going to hit Generate Test. You're going to select the type of responses that you want. For example, if I want multiple choice, type in your question, what is for times five. Your responses are your multiple choices. So for example, here's the answer. Whatever your answer is, is going to have this blue dot. Click another response or add a response. You can add as many or as few as you would like, and then you hit create. Now you've added your first question. To add a question below, you hit the plus below. To add a question above, click uh, the one above it. Once you have finished adding all of your questions. You can hit pending, create to active, go to administration. You're going to select the groups that you want these to take. So math, third grade math. If you want to include the accommodations, hit include so that they're already ready. And then you go to third grade for filtered grade. Now go to collection. This is where you're going to select your dates. So if I'm starting it on the 18th, then I may want it to go till the 12th. Now it should be all ready to go. Now that you've created your test, it will show up in your overview. To copy a test, go back to overview. Oh, here's my test right here that is pending. If you want to copy an existing test, go back to your overview page, go to assessments, new assessment, copy existing assessment. You're going to pick the type that you want. For example, it can be an SBA or a local benchmark or a CFA. You're going to go to the folder that you would like. You can click what you want to copy. This is what I just made. So then you hit copy. If you need to adjust anything, you do that right now. Generate test. And it's going to take you to that same page that we were just on. You're going to go to administration, select your students, and then also change the date. This is very important because it'll come back to the original date that you had done. To see your test, go back to your overview, and now you can see I have two of the same test right here. I hope that this tip has helped you learn how to create a new assessment and copy old ones now that we're using the new AWARE. Meet us back here for another Tech Tip Tuesday. Bye!